Oh, I forgot to ask. Did you ever end up finding a new roommate yet? Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, he moved in last week. Oh, for real? Who? Yo, this random guy I found online. He's kind of weird, though. Weird? How's he weird? You'll see. Bro, you don't have to do this every time. Yo, chill with the fireworks, bro. That's a fire hazard. Hey, how's it going, man? I'm Kyle. Kyle. Acknowledge me. What? Acknowledge you? What does that even mean? Bro, I have no idea. He's been doing this all week. Kyle, just say you acknowledge him and get it over with. Yo, I'm not gonna say that. Just do it, please. All right, I acknowledge you. Hey, yo, what's he pointing at? It's all me, baby. It's all me. Roman, you're gonna burn my house down, bro. Chill. There's no one else left. <laughs> hey, yo, Roman. Food's ready. Ladies and gentlemen. My name is Paul Heyman. I'm here as special counsel for your tribal chief! Introducing the reigning, defending, undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! Guy, you know you can just enter the room like a normal person, right? Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Is this guy sitting at the head of the table? Yes, my tribal chief. I, I think he is. Oh, come on, man. There's so many other seats that you can sit in. Nah. You need to move. Because I'm the head of the table. Nah, that ain't happening. Now, I'm not going to ask you again. I get that you own this house, but you answer to me now. Because you're not the head of the table. I am. Okay, fine. I'll switch seats. Damn. You good now? Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Follow me. Wait, Roman Reigns is your roommate? Like the guy from WWE? Yeah, he's been my roommate for like a week now. What? No way. My brother is a huge fan of his. He even made his own WWE championship belt out of cardboard. He wants to be a wrestler when he grows up. Yo, that's fire. What's fire? Oh, my friend's brother made a WWE championship belt out of cardboard. Nothing crazy though. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Did he just say his friend's brother has a WWE title? that I don't got? I believe so, my tribal chief. I want that title. It's just cardboard, it's worthless. I said, I want that title. Make it happen. Yo, is Roman here? Yeah, he is, why? This man just came to my house Speared my brother and took his cardboard title. No way. Yo, Roman! What's good? Oh, hey, Tandon. How's your brother? Bro, did you spear her brother and take his title? Nah. I didn't take this title. I earned it. Tell him, wise man. Your tribal chief earned this title opportunity and was successful because he's the reigning, defending wise man. Not right now. Roman, you can't be doing this, man. Roman, he's nine years old. Yeah? Well, I'm the tribal chief. Hey, I'm so sorry I'm late. My roommate has some family over last night. Hey, no worries. Take a seat. Congrats on Employee of the Month, by the way. Hey, thanks, boss. So as you guys know, I'm going to be promoting someone to CEO, and it comes with a high pay raise and a lot of benefits. Yo, that promotion is mine. I need that. So, Renvir. Uh, yes? Please make some room for the new CEO, Roman Reigns! Wait, what? Congrats. It's an honor. Thank you. Wait, he doesn't even work here. How'd he get this job? All right. 
my first order of business as CEO is to have everybody at this company acknowledge me. I ain't acknowledging nothing. Aaron Beer, you're fired. Hey, yo, chill. Yo, I'll acknowledge you, fam. Oh my gosh, guys, I made a huge mistake. The employee of the month is Roman Reigns, not Ranveer. Oh, come on. He hasn't even worked here for a full month yet. Thank you for acknowledging me. Hey, guys. So sorry I'm late. You ready to go home? Yeah, we've been waiting. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, finally. Okay, cool. Ladies and gentlemen! Who's this guy? I don't know. Yo, what's this guy doing on our bus, bro? My name is Paul Heyman. I have the unfortunate news to share with you that your beloved Miss Thompson has been formally let go from the school bus company. Wait, what? For real? No, not Miss Thompson. But I've been driving this same school bus for 40 years. They can't do that. They can, and they just did. Bro, she was my dad's bus driver, bro. You can't fire her. Listen, they can't fire me. I gotta drive these kids home, and they can't train a new driver now. Oh, on the contrary, Miss Thompson. I've spoken to the school board directly, and I, myself, have found a qualified candidate. Yeah? And who's that? that's replacing me? Have you ever even driven a bus before? Excuse me? I think his resume speaks for itself. What does any of that have to do with driving a bus? Listen, old lady. This, this is my bus now. Take your stuff and get out of here. Nah, you won't get away with this. I'll be back. All right, listen up. Wise man, hold that. Now, I don't know how they ran this bus before me, and frankly, couldn't care less. I've got some rules that each and every single one of you have to follow. Rule number one, there's no eating or drinking on my bus. Rule number two, there's no cell phones on my bus. And rule number three, you must acknowledge me as your tribal chief every single time you step on this bus. Got it? Man, you're not even my real bus driver. I'm not listening to any of that. What did I say about eating or drinking on my bus? Brian, you gotta chill out, bro. This guy means business. Ricky, man, shut up. Now, you know I gotta get my bus monitor to take care of you now, right? Bus monitor? What dork signed up for that job? <sighs> Solo. Solo? Ah! Ah! Oh! oh, shit. Yo, is he good? Brian, man, I told you to put it away. We tried to tell him. <laughs> Yo, I don't think he's breathing. Oh, uh, no, nah, it doesn't look like it. Now, does anyone else have any problems with the rules? No, we understand. Uh, no, nah, no, nah, I'm cool. Nah, we good. All right, and before we leave, I'm gonna need everyone's belts placed in this bag. What? Our belts? Yes, because I'm gonna add them to my collection. These are just belts for pants. They're still belts, are they not? Um, no. Yeah, no, yes. Well, then hand them over. Wise man, do what you have to do. Yes, my tribal chief. Put it in the bag. Man. Thank you. Make sure I get that back. You, bang, now. Oh, well, my pants are about to be mad loose. It's not my problem. Let's get a move on. Yo, big dog. What's good, bro? <laughs> nah, nah, I'm coming home now. Hey, yo, Zach, did you not learn from Brian, bro? Put your phone away. Yo, it's not even that serious, man. It's like a phone call. So what? Yo, yo, you watch Fast 10? Bro, I wanted to see that. Yo, Vin Diesel, yo, we family. <laughs> Dog, the tribal chief wants no phones, so put your phone away. 
Yo, I don't give a damn what the tribal chief say. <laughs> oh my god, my tribal chief! Oh, you on your own. Hey, yo, Romy, he didn't mean that. He was just playing. <laughs> Is that a phone? On my bus? Uh, yeah. So what if it is? Oh no. Apologize. What? I said, apologize! <laughs> oh, I make you laugh now? Am I a clown now? Huh? Bro, I suggest you apologize, like, right now. Well, I'm sorry, I left my phone on the bus! It's my phone now. What? No, where are you going? Don't leave me here! Hey! Roman, man, you didn't have to go that far. He's just trying to get home. Sometimes people need to learn their lessons. Now sit down. Nah, dog, that was messed up. I ain't sitting down nothing. Don't make me call Solo. Da! No, 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 Solo, we good, we good? I, I was about to sit down anyways. <laughs> That's what I thought. Hey, yo, Roman, I think you missed my stop. Bro, did you hear me? You passed my house. Listen, Ricky, some things are changing around here. Tell him, wise man. Roman has personally changed the route home to best benefit himself. He deemed your stop unworthy. A fam, that's where I live. No, I choose where you live now. Wait, what? Nah, this is ridiculous, bro. Get me off this bus, bro. You want off this bus? I give you opportunity after opportunity to get to your stop, and this is how you repay me? Roman, you already missed my stop. I might as well get an Uber. He's taking an Uber? Wise men, you know what to do. Man, I can't believe this guy's making me take an Uber, bro. Hold up. Is that Zach? Yo, Ricky! Hey, oh, my man. Yo, thank God I found you, bro. Roman Reigns took my phone and I didn't know how I was gonna get home. Listen, Zach, I got you. I just got an Uber. You can hop in. Okay, yeah, bro, perfect. How far away is he? Yo, let me check. <laughs> no way. What is it? It's him, fam. Wise man. Uber for Ricky. You're an Uber driver now? Yeah, you were just on the bus like five minutes ago. Your tribal chief decided to switch things up and got a new career as your Uber driver. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy and everything, but I'm not stepping foot in that car. Hell nah. <laughs> oh, you will be getting in this car. And that's not a prediction. That's a spoiler. What do you mean? I'll just call another Uber. Hell yeah. But there's no other drivers in the area. There's no one left. Wise man, there's no one left. No one left, my tribal chief. No one. I told them, I'm gonna pick everyone up and then I'm leaving. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna pick you two up and then we're leaving. All right, cool, but you're taking me straight home this time. And I want my phone back. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Ask him. Your tribal chief would like to know if you'd like a bottle of water or a piece of gum. Uh, nah, I'm good. Uh, yeah, I'm good too. Well, I'll have you know, your tribal chief strives for a five-star experience. Yeah, no, that's great. Um, can we keep going, please? I'm gonna be late for supper. Uh, yo, what's happening? I don't know. Uh, Roman? Are we gonna go today? You know, it's amazing how you don't get the plot around here. Your tribal chief doesn't drive when you want the tribal chief to drive. Your tribal chief drives when the tribal chief decides to drive. But wise man, he already started the trip. I'm getting charged for it right now. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief? I think I'm ready. That's fantastic news, my tribal chief.
Ooh, we have another Uber request, my tribal chief. Who is it? Oh, it's, uh... Jimmy Uso. You decline that. You decline that right now. Right away, my tribal chief. And report his account. Whoa, what did Jimmy Uso do to you? Long story. I don't want to talk about it. Your tribal chief is very sensitive to this topic. All right, all right. Uh, Roman, it's kind of quiet in here. You cool if we put on some music? No music. What? Why not? Listen, are we on some sort of vacation right now? No. This, this is strictly business. No music. Oh, come on, man. Let me connect to the aux cord. You think you can come in my car? Then tell me what to do? Ricky, chill, man. We, we don't need any music. We're fine. <laughs> Your tribal chief demands silence for the remainder of this trip. Oh, shit. What, what happened? Bro, my phone's about to die. Hold up. Sick. <gasps> did you just unplug your tribal chief's phone? Uh, yeah. What did I say about the music? Oh no, I wasn't gonna play music. I just needed to charge my phone. I always charge my phone in Ubers. Well, this isn't other Ubers. This is your tribal chief's Uber. Roman, you're at 99%. I'm at five. You plugged your tribal chief's phone back in this instant. This guy's getting a little too comfortable. Mr. Ricky. Your disobedience in this vehicle of relevancy is upsetting your tribal chief. I mean, when it comes to this Uber that I'm paying for, I'm the tribal chief now! <gasps> oh my god, my tribal chief! What did you do? What did you do? Bro, why would you say that? Wise man, take the wheel. Yes, of course, my tribal chief. Roman, I'm just trying to charge my phone. Hurry up back there, I don't even have a license. My tribal chief, we have reached our destination. You're lucky. Yo, get me out of here. Yo, same. And by the way, you better be giving your tribal chief five stars. Uh, yeah, five stars for sure. Wise man, let's go. Yes, my tribal chief. All right, take care. <laughs> yeah, this guy's definitely not getting five stars. He's getting two. Two? Why would you give him two stars? What if he finds out? Bro, he's not gonna find out. The rating's anonymous. Who? Uh oh. Uh, <laughs> who is it? It's your tribal chief. Now open up. Uh, Zach, open it. Hey, hey guys, what's up? I just got a notification that you gave your tribal chief two stars. It was all him. What? No, it wasn't me. <laughs> you, you took my phone, remember? No. I don't even have a phone. I saw it with my own two eyes. It was all him. No. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Fix the rating. Yeah, no, for sure. I'll get right on that. Wise man? Yes, my tribal chief. I gotta go pick up my kid. Very well, my tribal chief. So unfortunately, your son is gonna have to redo the fifth grade. Wait, what? Again? Yeah. You can go now. Next. My name is Paul Heyman Jr. Yeah, Paul Heyman Jr., I know who you are. You're in my class. I'd like to present to you the wise man, my dad, Paul Heyman. That's my son. I'm so proud of you. Wait, who are you? Where's Mr. Reigns? Your tribal chief refuses to enter the premises unless you can double down on security for this building. Uh, for what reason? So your tribal chief does not get interrupted by the Usos. I mean, I don't even know who the Usos are. Is that a band? Well, can you guarantee that the Usos won't interrupt this meeting? Yeah, sure, I guess. Call Roman Reigns. Do you mind if we hurry this up? I have other meetings. Introducing your tribal chief's son, Roman Reigns Jr. Uh, Roman Reigns Jr., where's your dad? And finally, introducing the reigning, defending, 
undisputed universal champion, Roman Reigns! What are they pointing at? Wanted to see me, Miss Smith? Uh, yes, I wanted Miss to. Miss Smith, um, before we begin, acknowledge me. Uh, okay, sure. I can acknowledge you. I acknowledge you, my tribal chief. Thank you, wise man. I acknowledge you, my tribal chief. Thank you, wise man, Junior. I acknowledge you, Dad. Thank you, son. You're gonna make your old man cry. Uh, all right, Mr. Reigns, do you mind if we get started? Sure. What's this about? Uh, it's actually about Roman Reigns Jr.'s behavior. Okay. What about him? Uh, it seems like he's been playing a little rough with the kids out at recess. Roman Jr. Yes, Dad? This true? No, Dad. It's not true. Well, there you have it. He didn't do it. Yeah, but the thing is, it did happen. Multiple students have come to me about it. Are you calling my son, who's a part of my bloodline, a liar? Uh, with all due respect, Mr. Reigns, uh, students have been telling me that he's hitting them with Superman punches and spears. Would you happen to know anything about that or where he even learned that from? Um, <clears throat> no, uh, actually, uh, I, I, I wouldn't. <laughs> Are you sure? Don't you do both these things on TV? Uh, wise man? Yes, my tribal chief. Doctor, Miss Smith. Your tribal chief, Roman Reigns, has been universal champion for over a thousand days. So show some respect and don't falsely accuse his son. Uh, Dad? Yes, son? The truth is, I did hit one kid with the Superman punch. See? Told you. What? You... which kid? Hey, it's Roman Lames Jr. Who is this guy? That's Johnny. He's been bullying me ever since he transferred here. Hey kid, you've been bullying my son? I see it now. Clown? Mega clown. <laughs> <gasps> oh my goodness! You do not talk to your tribal chief like that! Oh, a clown? Oh, do I make you laugh now? Is this a joke? Did I stutter? Oh, you listen to me. Don't make me come over there and make me teach you a lesson. Mr. Reigns! I... What is it? You can't talk to the students like that. You're a grown man. I apologize, Miss Smith. Wise man, Junior. Yes, my travel chief? Talk to him. Don't make me come over there and teach you a lesson. Paul Heyman, Junior. Guys, come on. You apologize to your travel chief and his son now. You can be a good wise man one day. You apologize this instant. Nah, I'm good. You're good? You're good? What? This is the respect you show me in my son's classroom? Solo! No, no, my tribal chief, no, not solo. Please, not solo. Da! Mr. Reigns, make him stop, he's just a kid. Yeah, teach this kid a lesson, I bet. <sighs> my tribal chief, I understand your frustration, but you could face some jail time and we have money in the bank next week. Fine. Solo, stand down. I bet you know where to find me. <sighs> You're lucky, kid. You know what? Because of that, I'm gonna get my dad to beat up your dad. <laughs> your father stands no chance against the head of the table, the tribal chief. I'd like to see your dad even try to get me off my feet. I mean, he already has. Wise man, what is this fool talking about? Yes, please, elaborate. He didn't get me off my feet. I don't even know his dad. No. <gasps> is that, is that the Usos, my tribal chief? Jimmy Uso, you said there'd be security in this building. Jimmy, 
This your kid? Yeah, that's my son. He's a part of the bloodline. The bloodline? Yeah, and I'm here to pick him up. You live in this area now? Yeah, we just moved in. Come on, Oos, let's go home. Uncle Jay got a barbecue going. And Roman? He ain't invited. Coming, Oos. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Pack your things. It's time to move. Call Roman Reigns' real estate agent. Yo, what is that? What? Hey, yo, what's going on? Well, your tribal chief, Roman Reigns, has been looking for a suitable house in this neighborhood. And he so happened to choose this one. Mine? Bro, my house isn't even on sale though. Wow, as you can clearly see, now it is. Now, if you'll excuse me, your tribal chief is almost here to explore the residence of relevancy. Listen, I don't know how else to tell you this, but you're not putting my house on sale. My tribal chief has arrived! <laughs> tribal chief? Bro, yeah. oh, is this guy trying to move in today? Welcome to the neighborhood, my tribal chief! Would you like a tour of the house? No time. I'll take it. That's wonderful news, my tribal chief. Welcome home. Bro, my great-grandfather built this crib with his own two hands, bro. You can't take this from me. Take that sign down. Home sweet home. Sign here, my tribal chief. And here. And here. Wonderful. Welcome to your new house. Thank you, wise man. <laughs> Bro, if you think I'm gonna sign that document, you must have been hit with one too many super kicks. That's fine. We don't need it. Wait, what? Yo, is that even legal? Of course it is. I personally spoke to the president myself, and he gave an executive order to switch the title of this house in your tribal chief's name. Nah, this is crazy. Yo, I gotta get my lawyers on the phone. Excuse me? Roman Reigns is your Universal Champion, your WWE Champion, and now he's the new homeowner of your house! Roman, at least give me a few days to pack my things, bro, please! Nah, you're out of time, cause we're moving in now! Boys, boxes, let's go! Yo, listen, I ain't give no one permission to walk inside my house. Hey, be careful with those. Those are your tribal chief's plaques. Well, you better take that box back to the truck. Bro, at least take off your shoes. Yo, Ricky. Bro, I didn't know that you were moving, bro. What is this? That's the thing, bro. I'm not moving. Yo, this guy just jacked my crib. Yo, what's up, man? I'm Tyler. I'm your new neighbor. What's up? Glad you moved in. Bro, he's not your neighbor. I am. My name is Paul Heyman, and this is your reigning, defending, undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. It's nice to meet you. All right. All right. Yeah, ni nice to meet you guys. Tyler, is it? Are there any other neighbors in the area that we should be looking out for? Hmm? Yeah, man, the neighborhood's good. The neighborhood's great, actually. Uh, it's just a couple people you gotta look out for. Hmm. Like who? Over there? It's Ronda Rousey. Hey, guys. Yeah. We like her. Hey! What? Oh, what are you doing in front of my house? I'm just going for a walk, lady. No, get out of here. Uh, oh. Sometimes. Yeah, and uh, over there, that's Dominic. Hey, yo, why are you looking at me like that? 
Don't make me have to call mommy on you. It's cool, Dom. Yeah, we, we good. We good. I served hard time and survived. Couldn't say the same thing about you, though. We get it, Dom. Yeah, you don't have to keep going. You don't have to keep doing this. Imagine being locked up with the world's most dangerous people, not knowing when your next meal is going to be. Dom, you only spent one night in jail. Knock it off. All right, Dom. All right, yeah, yeah. Just go inside and find mommy. That sounds like a good idea. Hey, your mommy. Wait a second. Is that the beast incarnate? Brock Lesnar. Hey, Paul. Hey, uh, I've got a package for a Brock Lesnar. Yeah, that's me. Come here. Uh, yeah. That's gonna leave a mark. Yeah. Yeah, it is. He's got a he's got a little bit of a temper issue. He's been actually just dropping dudes left and right. UPS worker pulled up two weeks ago, got bodied. It was insane. Wise man. Uh, yes, my tribal chief. I think this neighborhood will be suitable to raise my bloodline. Wonderful, my tribal chief. Uso! Yo, Jimmy and Jay, what's up, man? I was just welcoming our new neighbors, yeah. Roman and uh... Tyler, we're well aware of who these guys are. What's good, Us? Jay, how was the barbecue? Well, you wouldn't know, cause Us wasn't invited. Y'all had a barbecue? I wasn't invited. Hey, yo, good one, Jay. You got jokes. So, you just move in? Yeah, this, this is my house now. Actually, we're, we're still sorting out the details. It's not quite his house just yet. Quiet, you! Uh, okay, yeah, my fault, my fault. Hey, Jimmy, yeah, Jay? Yo, is this guy welcome into our neighborhood? Nope. So is he just mad that I pinned him at Money in the Bank last weekend? Yup. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Hold these. Of course. Oh, you really want to step up right now? For real? Yeah, I do. What you gonna do? You ain't gonna do nothing. Hey, what's going on out here? You leave us alone, John. I got this. Back up, John. He's mine. Uh, okay. Uh, let me know if you need anything. You nothing without me. The only reason why you even own a house is because of me. Understand that? Yeah, yeah that's how you feel, eh? Hey, yo, always chill. There's a Fetty. Afternoon, gentlemen. Everything okay here? You'll be good, Chief. All right, good. Because if there was an issue, I'd have to take all y'all to the penitentiary. I ain't trying to go to the penitentiary. You mean the Uso penitentiary? Nah. Guantanamo Bay. Nah. I ain't trying to go to Guantanamo Bay, bro. Guess we'll be seeing you around, Deuce. You know where to find me. At my new house. I bet. Hey, yo, garbage day's on Thursday. Wise man, write that down. Hey, right away. All right, let's go get settled in our new home. All right, let's go. Wait. You've been barred from entering your tribal chief's house. Yo, where am I supposed to sleep then, bro? I got no food. <sighs> oh, hey, Rick. Morning, Roman. How'd you sleep? Bro, I got like six bedrooms in there. You couldn't let me sleep in one? Wise man. Today's gonna be a good day. Oh my goodness, my tribal chief! My fault, you passed my ball back? Is this your soccer ball on my property? Uh, yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, my buddy just accidentally kicked it a little too hard. Ah. <sighs> ah. <sighs> Solo! Solo? Wait, what? Da! Da! Are you Mr. Roman Reigns? Yeah. Who's asking? I'm Ron. This is Jeremy. We're from the Bank of the United States. We've seized all your belongings, including this house. What? <sighs> Wise man. Handle this. Your tribal chief would like to know why his belongings are being seized. Well, unfortunately, the bank has not received any payments for Mr. Reigns. So, in other words, you're, you're broke, fam. Yeah. Broke? 
What are you talking about? I'm the WWE Universal Champion. I ain't broke. Oh, yes, thanks for reminding me. The bank actually owns those as well. Let go of them! Let go! No! My tribal chief, they took the belts! Listen, you can't take my belts. I earned them. <laughs> well, according to your bank statements, you're earning nothing. Because you're broke. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Fix this. Anyways, have a great day. Can I try one of these? Yeah, for sure. Oh, nice. Call Roman Reigns' financial advisor. All right, we're gonna do a ladder match next. Nah, man, I'm off this. We've been playing for like 12 hours now. I said, we're gonna do a ladder match next. Okay, okay, we'll play one more. What? What do you think you're doing? Okay, sick. Locked in. You can't be the tribal chief. Because I'm the tribal chief. Roman, you're the tribal chief in real life. Let me at least play him in the game. No, you pick another guy right now. All right, if I can't play as Roman, I'm playing as Jay Uso. Except him. No, Zos. Nah, it's too late now. Sorry to interrupt my tribal chief, but may I have a little word with you for a second? What is it, wise man? I've been running the numbers, my tribal chief, and it seems the debt is piling up and nothing's coming in. Yeah, I, I know. I'll deal with it later. Everything will be fine. Yo, Ricky, hit start. Roman, we need to handle this right now. Yeah, you guys literally took my house and had it seized by the bank. And now you want to live at my mom's house? Listen, Ricky, we're going to stay here as long as we need to. You got it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, for sure. I guess my mom's cool with like one, two more weeks. <laughs> and wise man, may I remind you that I pay you to deal with this kind of stuff? Now go take care of it. Well, I mean, you don't really pay me because of the debt. I really need to get paid right now. I wonder if the Usos are hiring. Just find a way to get us paid, and when you figure it out, come back. Till then, I have a ladder match to win. Well, I mean, I do have an idea, but you're probably not gonna like it. Well, what is it? Spit it out. In the meantime, it would be in your best interest to get an occupation. Wait a minute. Find an occupation? You don't mean. He means quit being a broke bum and get a job. And maybe take a shower while you're at it. Wise man, is this true? Well, considering the circumstances, this is your best option. Wise man, buddy, there's gotta be another way. My tribal chief, do you wanna get your titles back or not? Of course, more than anything. Well, in order to do so, this is the only way. Fine, but listen, I choose the job and you make it happen. You got it? Of course, my tribal chief. Whatever job you like. All right. I think I have one in mind. What is it? So it says here you've been a WWE superstar for 10 years, and now you want to become a doctor? That's correct. Do you have any experience in the medical field? I was once in an ambulance match against Braun Strowman back at the Great Balls of Fire pay-per-view in 2017. What's an ambulance match? You see, the point of this match is to incapacitate your opponent to the point where you can throw them in the back of an ambulance. Wait, what does any of this have to do with becoming a doctor? What are you talking about? I throw people in the back of ambulances, and doctors throw people in the back of ambulances. It's the same thing. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work out. Dr. AJ, we have a patient in 3A who's a code red. We're about to lose him. No, not a code red. Where's Dr. Hendricks? He couldn't make it in time. Okay, I gotta find a replacement. Give me some time. Dr. AJ, you don't understand. We don't have time to waste. We need someone right now. Well, I don't have someone right now. Doctor, I think we have a replacement here after all. He's talking about me. What? No, I can't let you go in there. You're not even a real doctor. Then I suppose you'll lose this patient. <sighs> no, I can't let that happen. That'll be the eighth one this week. Jimmy, what do you think? <sighs> well, I don't think we have a choice. Am I gonna make it out, Doc? No. I'm sorry, my man. It just doesn't look good for you. What? For real? Unfortunately, we don't have a doctor that's qualified enough to perform such a delicate operation. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Heyman. And I 
would like to introduce to you the reigning, the Frosky, just get me a doctor. With pleasure, introducing your doctor, Roman Reigns. All right, Doc, I'll take it from here. All right, fine. Try your best. You sure you can help me? Relax. You're in good hands now. You're in the Tribal Chief's hands. Okay, I trust you. Scalpel. Oh, shit. <laughs> Stapler. Ah. Ah, ah, it's looking good. I think you're gonna be okay. For real? How many of these surgeries have you done? This is my first one. Wait, what? Saw. Saw? Saw. Ah, ah, oh, yo, chill, chill. In all my years of medical school, I've never seen this technique before. Trust me, I'm a doctor. Ah. My tribal chief. I think we lost him. Wow, how, how did you lose him? All he had was a sprained ankle. Wise man, I did everything I could. He was in the Jabal Chief's hands, but now he's in God's hands. Let's go. Well, that didn't work. Yeah, let's just stay away from hospitals from now on. Okay, my tribal chief, what else do you have in mind? Wise men, are you afraid of heights? All right, we are now reaching the altitude of 30,000 feet. Listen, kid, I know you're in training, but you need to pay attention to every single thing that I'm doing so you can learn, okay? Captain Bernie, Bernie, wake up! Mayday, Mayday! Our captain is incapacitated. We lost control of the plane. Mayday, Mayday! Does anyone know how to fly a plane? I can fly this plane. What? Who are you? How'd you get in here? This is Captain Roman Reigns. And he's gonna be landing this plane, so you better show him some respect. Oh, okay, so you're, you're aware of the landing procedure, right? The landing what? You know this job takes years of training, right? You can't just hop in the cockpit and expect to land a plane, man. Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Hold my hat. All right, listen here, buddy. Is this an interview, or do you want me to save your life along with the hundreds of passengers on board? If there's one man for the job, it's your tribal chief. Now move out of the way. Okay, all right, fine. Come on, Bernie, let's get out of here. <sighs> oh, I'm not feeling so good. Here you go, my tribal chief. Thank you, wise man. Let's go land this plane. All right, stand back. I got this. How's it looking? Not good. What, really? Yeah, we're going down. Going down? Wise man? Yes, my tribal chief. Get my parachute right away. All right, Thank you. hop on my back. Can I hop on your back too? All right, my tribal chief, this this job thing, it's it's not working out. Yeah, I know it's not. Yo, how have you guys not found a job yet? Zip it, Ricky. I know exactly what we're doing. Wise man, what are we doing? Hmm, I think I have the perfect idea. Well, what is it? We find a job that's Less extreme. And what job would that be? Wise men? Yes, my tribal chief? Your brilliant idea is to work at a pizza shop? My tribal chief, this is only temporary, so please try not to hurt anyone this time. I promise I'll try my best. And besides, it's a great job. You get full benefits, a paid vacation, and Solo gets to eat pizza for free. Ah. Guess that's true. But as soon as I get my titles back, I'm out of here. Believe me, 
You'll be out of here in no time. Oh, my tribal chief! It's their first customer! Say what you learned in training. Good afternoon, sir. Welcome to Super Choice Pizza. May I tell you about our deal of the day? Uh, no thanks. I'm just gonna have a cheese slice. What? Did you say? Um, I just wanted a cheese slice. Oh, you want a cheese slice? You think you can tell the tribal chief what to do? Uh, sorry, uh, do you work here? Like, no disrespect, I, I just wanted a cheese slice for lunch. Ooh! Oh, no, no, my tribal chief! No, 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 no! No, like, no! What's going on here? I don't understand. Uh -oh. Ooh! Get your own cheese slice. My tribal chief, what are you doing? That's a customer! This guy tried telling me what to do. I had to remind him who's in charge here. You know what, my tribal chief? Let's get you off the register and have you do something a little less stressful. All right, fine by me. You're doing a wonderful job, my tribal chief. And don't forget the corners. <laughs> Oh boy. Jay Uso. Hey yo, what up, Uso? What do you want, Jay? Yo, word on the block was the almighty tribal chief was working a nine to five. I had to see it for myself. Oh, is that so? Well, shouldn't you be visiting Jimmy at the hospital where I put him? <laughs> hey, you got jokes, eh? Why don't you focus up for a match on Saturday? <laughs> Unless you gotta work now. No, I'll be there. Right, wise man? My, my book off request got approved, right? Yes, yes it did, my tribal chief. I bet. See you Saturday, homie. Hello? Oh, you did? Wonderful. I'm coming right now. Wise man, where are you going? My tribal chief. We're rich again! <laughs> Here you go, my tribal chief. No way. Oh, I've missed these. Ooh. Wise man? Yes, my tribal chief. Let's get out of here. Wait, my tribal chief, aren't you missing something? Uh, I, I don't think so. I have the universal and my WWE title. What else am I missing? This! Oh. My God. Thank you, wise man. Now, let's go celebrate. Call Roman Reigns' girlfriend. Good night, babe. Ugh, good night. Roman, wake up. What is it, babe? I need to ask you something. It's been on my mind lately. Not right now. The tribal chief needs his rest. <sighs> I think it's finally time for me to meet your parents. What? You want to meet the elders? Yeah, obviously. We've been together for nine years. Don't you think it's time? <sighs> okay, fine. Wise men. Yes, my tribal chief. Schedule a dinner between me, the elders, Bianca, and you, wise man. Ugh, does wise man really have to come? Of course. He's my wise man. If you had a wise man, he'd come too. It's an honor, my tribal chief. Wise man, get my title polished. We're going to dinner with the elders. Um, no, you're not bringing your title. Hey, mom. Dad. Nice to see you. Hey, champ. How's it going? Hey, honey. So glad you can make it. Guys, this is my girlfriend, Bianca. Hi, it's 
so nice to finally meet you. Nice to meet you, Bianca. Come on in. It's so crazy. You look just like your mom and dad. Really? I, I don't see it. You guys are just in time. Hold up. Where's Wise Man? <gasps> Mr. and Mrs. Reigns! Wise Man, come on in. I didn't think you were gonna show up. All right, let's dig in. Wait, honey, don't eat yet. There's one more person joining us. One more person? Who? Hey, hey sorry guys, I'm late. Jay. Roman. Guys, you didn't tell me that this guy was gonna be here. Yeah, Oos, had I known he was coming, I would've never came. Oh babe, is this the cousin that you beat at SummerSlam? It's so nice to meet you, Jay. I'm Bianca, Roman's girlfriend. Sup, Bianca? Babe, save it. We don't associate with this guy. He doesn't acknowledge me. Roman, this is not how I raised you. Can someone tell me why this man is sitting at the table right now? Well, with everything that happened at SummerSlam, we thought that this dinner would help patch things up and get you guys back together. Nah, I ain't patching up nothing. Roman needs to go. He ain't welcome here. Nah, Jay. Oh boy. You ain't welcome here. Jimmy, so good to see you, pal. Jimmy, you're here too, eh? What is this, the meeting of the snakes? Yo, Jay, why don't you quit disrespecting the chief and sit down and eat? Nah, I ain't eating here. Especially with the man that stabbed me in the back. Listen, I had to do what I had to do for the bloodline, baby. We appreciate that, Jimmy. You know what, guys? Why don't we just calm down and have dinner like a family? Can we do that for once? Okay, fine. Anything for you, Auntie Reigns. <sighs> bon appetit. Uh, yeah, I don't see any more seats for me. Uh, Y'all got some in the back? Wait, there's something missing. Gonna put this here. Roman, no titles on the dinner table. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, no, uh, no, no titles on the table, son. Ugh, babe, I told you not to bring that. Oh, isn't this the same belt that you didn't win at SummerSlam, Jay? Cool it, Oos. If it wasn't for that snake, Jimmy, that title would have been mine. So, uh, Bianca. How did you meet my son? Yes, please elaborate how my son met such a fine, lovely woman like yourself. Oh, uh, <clears throat> sorry, babe. Funny story, one night I was swiping on Tinder and that's when I found his profile. Ew, no, Ugh, gross. Swipe left, swipe left, swipe left. Swipe. Oh, wait, my tribal chief, she's pretty cute. She has a dog. I don't like dogs. Swipe left. Oh, he's cute. Hold up. Super like. It's a match, my tribal chief. Wise man, schedule a meeting with her. Wow, that's so romantic. What was that app called? Tinder? And where'd you guys go on your first date? Uh, at an arcade. Oh, an arcade. That must have been fun. Um, not really. Wow. My tribal chief, you got the highest score. I know. Let's get out of here. Oh my God! Yay, babe! I just beat your high score. You're now in second place. <laughs> Wise man. Yes, my tribal chief. Did she just say that I came in second place? I think she did, my tribal chief. You know what, wise men? You get back on that game, and you get my first place back. But, but my tribal chief, her, her score is quite high. It might take a bit. I don't care if we're here all night. You get back on that game, and you get my score back. You heard me? Ain't no one beating the Tribal Chief. Not even my girl. Get 
Can I stop now in my tribal chief? No. You keep going till I get that high score. Oh! Yes! Yes! We got the high score, my tribal chief! <laughs> no. You didn't do it. I did. Let's go, wise man. Atta boy, son. That's how I raised you. Us reigns don't end up in second place. Thanks, old man. Shit, <laughs> not surprised you got wise man to be your score, since you can't do nothing yourself. Wait, what'd you say? Yeah. What'd you say? Jay. No. Wait, what? No, no, no. I didn't say anything. No. Be a man. What'd you say? Babe, let's just calm down and forget about it. Babe, not right now. Wise man, your tribal chief just asked you what you said, so say it! I said I'm not surprised you got wise men to beat your score since you can't do nothing yourself! <gasps> My tribal chief, he said it, he said it! Oh, you really want to scrap right now? At my mom's house? I'm always ready! Wise man, yes, my tribal chief? Get me a referee. I'm on it. It's gonna be a long night. You sure you want this, Jay? This is all I want. That title is mine. Oh my god, this is not what I expected. All right, ring the bell. Ring the bell! Wait, mom, stop, you're embarrassing me. If you guys have to fight right now, move my coffee table. If that breaks, you both are dead. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, Jay, uh, do you mind getting the other side? Yeah, I got you. All right, <clears throat> you got it? Yeah, I got it. Right, cool, thanks, bro. Got you. Cool. <clears throat> uh, mom, is, is it good here? Yeah, you're good. Continue. All right, sick. All right, cool. All right, you ready? Aye, right, let's get it. I gave you your wings. Does this usually happen at these family dinners? Go, my tribal chief, go! No, Jay, don't do it! He's your cousin! He's your blood! He loves you! No! Not the Uso Splash! What's an Uso Splash? Yeah, it's a Uso Splash! Yo, who did that? Nah, not again. No. Sorry, Jay. Can't let it end like this. This is the weirdest family I've ever seen. <sighs> ah! Ooh, did not see that coming. You're gonna fit right in, Jimmy. <sighs> uh. One, two, three. <sighs> uh. Yes. That's my job, Chief, right there. Wise man, babe, let's get out of here, right away. Roman, I'm not going anywhere. What do you mean? Me and you, we're done. Done? Wait, are, are you breaking up with me? You're breaking up with us? Yes. This is not working out. Goodbye, forever. Babe, what about Roman Jr.? You really fumbled the bag on this one, son. Absolutely no riz. You got that from your mom. Wise man. It's time to look for a new girlfriend. Siri, re-download Tinder.